Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Thomas. Tonight we're back here with Plant on Reddit Stories. Today, well, I don't want to watch the rules because we got ourselves dumb things our school banned. So yeah, the things that got banned at school. So, I, again, I don't remember much from school, so I don't really know any, like, things that got banned were very dumb. I don't have any, like, uh, context in a way. <laughs> Anywho, so let's see these dumb things. Oh, be sure to like subscribe for more. Hope you enjoy. Let's go. Planet Dolan. Here we go. Bet you. Right. From talking in the hallways to clapping at school assemblies, the Planet Dolan okay. crew reenact some of the best true stories from oh, our boy, subreddit about the dumbest things our schools have ever banned. Let's begin. I'm Doopy, and today I'll be your narrator. Hey, you Number doing, okay. 10 was submitted by Tom go. Odayama. Being in a Catholic school, Dolan was in 5th grade and his sister was in 7th grade when they learned of the silly things uh, that were banned. The there were be usual older? things that were banned like Beyblade cards and handheld should, games, but the dumbest be thing to have been banned happened one winter what? from a new principal at the time. There was plenty of snow and many kids liked to make snow forts and snowmen, but there were should? a good amount of troublemakers who would have snowball fights on the school grounds. So the new it's principal had taken That's action normal. one day and turned on the speakers mm. to talk to the school. They it say. has come to my attention that there have been many incidents involving snow. Therefore, yeah. there are going to be some changes. There will be no more playing with snow, touching of snow, or even standing on snow. Wait, I hope standing? that our school grounds will be a what? safer place for everyone while at school. Pardon? Standing on snow? Dolan doesn't know how someone bans standing on snow during recess, when the whole grounds are never shoveled. Wow. Needless to say, yeah, the walk home from very, school very with his dumb. sister was full of laughter Yeesh. at how stupid it sounded. Number 9 was submitted Oof. by Cape Industries. Hmm. One time when Snoopy was in third grade, okay. there was a ban on sneezing. At the time, there was a large Sneezing? amount of dust in the school, so whenever the teacher Oof. called on her, Snoopy would sneeze three times and would get yelled at. They would tell her to leave, but she would tell them to clean the school better because there's a ton of dust just sitting on the desks and nothing is done about it. Seriously? In the end, Snoopy left the school and, in the next school year, the school was closed due to health code violations. Number yeah. eight was submitted I'm by dust. Anonymous you might want to get new, uh, Once, when Tolo was at school, he mm -hmm. decided to eat his sweet snacks only. He oh. went and sat on the bench in the field, and after opening his lunch, he pulled out ten yeah. different sweets. When he started eating them, the teacher strolled by and looked over his shoulder. She saw the four empty wrappers and looked at the other six sweets and said to him, Haven't you read the new rule in the school diary? Then, she took what? all his sweets and dumped them in the bin. Tola Boy. was in so much shock Ow. that he went up to the school principal and asked him about it. All he had to say was, I'm sorry, but many parents are blaming us for tooth decay for selling sweets and allowing them at school. He walked away, so Tola decided not to get angry, but to get even. He went Bro. home and planned There's his revenge. Real. He made 12 batches of cupcakes, but without the sugar and salt. He put a cupcake on almost every teacher's desk with a little note on the bottom of the cupcake paper saying, Since sweets are banned, I made all the teachers sugarless cupcakes so they aren't sweets anymore. Enjoy! The ban was lifted and the principal gave Tolop a detention, but also thanked him. Number seven. Like, really? Tooth decay? Like, don't blame the school. Blame your, blame your kids' bad hygiene habits. Like, I mean, jeez. I mean, you still got a brush. Like, come on, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Apparently, no one's ever told him how to brush right. Anyway, moving on. Then was submitted by Volatin Tooth. Oh, God. Just a few years ago, when Mikhailum was in his senior year okay. of high school, the school started to really crack down on security, following huh? every last law and rule there was. This included the this. laws of stalking of a minor. In the state where he grew up, it is illegal to take a picture of a person younger than 18 without their direct consent. Oh. At certain times of the day, like lunch, students could have their phones out. But as soon as these rules came into play, they had this? teachers monitoring them at all times. People caught using the camera app, even if accidental, were given detention and even occasionally suspended. 
cameras okay, were confiscated immediately, and their memories were wiped. The school Bro. photography class was shut down. Not that bad for a normal school, but this school was well renowned Dude. around the country for its art program. The strange thing yeah, is, yeah, that's not gonna it's help your school to reputation. Of a minor so you like your band, as long as you yourself club. are a minor, which almost everyone in the school was. Number I mean, six was submitted by Fred Astaire Alcatraz. When Emoji was about to leave his primary school, the principal yeah. became meaner and unfair. He uh -oh. made a rule that the students couldn't say anything to censor out a swear word like fork or shoot. Emoji Seriously? thought this was a bit unfair, so he went and talked to the principal. We should yeah. be allowed to say fork if we get hurt, not if we talk about sex. Emoji said. True. Almost everyone in his school year level agreed with him. The principal said that it was a stupid idea, so Emoji <laughs> said, Here we go. Go, fork, go yourself. fork yourself. And left the <laughs> office. To Who this you, day, principal? he's still proud of that. Number nice. five I was submitted by Ermac Falcon. <laughs> Dolan's brother went to a charter school for most of his young life, so there were a lot of oh. things that were banned from the get-go. He was in ninth grade, and the school suddenly started getting stricter. They enforced a rule banning everyone from talking in the hallways Seriously? between classes. Unfortunately, this was extremely easy to enforce because the school oh. was only one floor and had only one hallway spanning the length of the building. Ouch. It gave some stupid excuse, Ooh. like, students should be on their best behavior during school hours. As if Seriously? they thought taking away their only time to socialize besides lunchtime would make them behave better. You can Seriously? probably guess why mostly every student became a jerk after that. Number yeah, four no, was no submitted outlet. by Oof. the AU called Meh. <laughs> Hellbent's middle school banned the red pen. If really? a red pen was used, students would get suspended from school. It all started Seriously? with one kid, Nixium, telling his parents that he did not like the red pin marks that the teachers did on their tests or classwork. So one day, the parents went to the school and talked to the teachers and principal about the red pins. The next day, red pins were banned. No one, not even the teachers, could use a red pin. Instead, everyone had to Bro. use a black or blue pin. Number three. Seriously? Sheesh. Like. I'll be real, if someone threatened that me in a lawsuit, I'm gonna be like, go ahead. We'll see how far you go. Is that fair? I'd probably honestly call their bluff, because let's be real. Bring the parents to this? Like, come on. I mean, you gotta admit, like, the red pen? Really? Like, really? Ugh. You gotta admit, that's pretty dumb. Anyway. It was submitted by Beverage Gaming. Animations was in third grade when a stupid new principal entered her school. Oh now everyone thinks a new principal should be cool and stuff, but this one sucked. She literally took away clapping at assemblies because she said really? it was too loud. Everyone she had to do the stupid to jazz listen. hand thing. Probably yes. the worst though is that she took away the game tag. Andy was so Seriously? mad, and literally all they did was throw balls at each other from that day forward. Ugh. But then they got a new principal who was a guy and was so swag. Andy and the other students rules. can do whatever they want now. Number two was submitted by Tiger Flame 703. So in Lechna's middle school, hugs yeah. and high fives were banned. The really? reason was because That's it would make fives? other people feel like they were not included. In Lex's opinion, it was the dumbest thing he has ever heard because it sounded like they were trying to mm -hmm. say that if you hug one person, you had to hug everyone else, whether you knew uh, them or not. Yeah, Number no one one's going to be doing that. Me. When I was in middle school, touching any other student was banned. Absolutely prohibited. Eh. If you did something so much as rub your arm against another student by accident or not, you would get a warning before you got suspended. And Seriously? it was awful. <laughs> you also couldn't Oof. wear earrings at I all. Mean, you couldn't wear earrings. Seriously? And they just really one? didn't have a reason for any of this. They just said that you couldn't. I kept getting in trouble because I kept getting caught hugging my friends in the hallway. So <laughs> yeah, it was a special Yeah, that would have been torture for me. I'm Huge a hugger. thanks to the- f Yeah, I'll be real, that last one, I'm like, dude, I mean, I'll be real. I mean, if I know someone, I'm a hugger, but 
Jesus, I don't think even I would have lasted so long in that school. I would be like, if I got that, that once, I mean like, this fool's dumb, I'm out. Or something like that, I'd probably leave the school. Like, seriously, touch, like, no hugs? Like, come on, guys. <sighs> Sorry, but still, like I said, I'm a hugger. You know, if I know someone, I'll hug them. So, I mean, if they give okay, you know? Eesh. Anyway, so, hope you guys enjoyed that one. Yeesh, those are dumb. So, until next time, like, subscribe for more. See ya.